you know, you obviously want to enjoy this for like the next 24 hours and then obviously move on and uh, start our process all over again. So, definitely. Is that going to be a test to see if you guys are right there at the elite? Absolutely. Absolutely. Opportunity to compete against the best. We respect every opponent, but um, definitely got to definitely gotta be on our be on our role for, uh, for next week. So. What kind of, uh, you know, improvements did you guys want to make in this game just to kind of, you know, put Louisville behind you, obviously, and just kind of, you know, fix whatever you needed to before you take that road trip to Georgia? Um, definitely just, like, working on the finite details that got us here. Um, you know, everybody, everybody wants to perform. Everybody wants to perform well. Um, and sometimes, you know, that can cloud, you know, small things jumping off sides. You know, it's like small details, um, your technique. You know, focus on the things that got you here initially um, instead of being so outcome based. So, uh, you know, we definitely want to lock in. We took a bye week to really focus on ourselves and really get back to the tangibles that got us here. Uh, we were able to put that on display today. How about the number of playmakers you had that were on display today? That's got to be a good sign. Absolutely. I mean, like I said, the guys, guys put their all into this, man. Like um, our off season program, uh, I. It, it's it's unique in the sense that not a lot of people would be able to do it. So, you know, when you put so much in, when you invest so much of yourself, your effort and your energy into something, you definitely want to put put your best foot forward at any time that you can go out and perform. So I think guys really want to – guys every time we step on the field, any time we get an uh, opportunity to compete, they want to give it everything they've got. So. Kelly's talked a couple times about how – I think it's in his practice conferences – how you had a really good off season. Um and to watch out for you. Does that – do you hear that stuff? Does that motivate you at all to know who's saying that? Um, it's cool. It's cool, but at the end of the day, like just focusing on the process, man. Um, being so fo focused, process, pro focus on the process, um, and obviously focusing on the tangibles that got us here. Like I said, um, it's something that you know you don't want to really get too caught up in it. Um, but you know, I'm grateful to be in this position. And I'm grateful to be able to go out and help my team. So, just to follow up, can you share one unique thing about the off season? You mentioned uh, there's a uniqueness to it. Um, you know, I, I honestly, holistically, just the mental space, physical space that I've been in um, as of late, like, you know, just really just that with the end of last season. Um, it's just really been a overall, in, like, several aspects of being balanced. Uh, you know, really just a bunch of things that would personally just work for me the best. And uh, just finding the right way to kind of keep everything in perspective um, has been, like, huge for me and being able to just focus on what I need to do to help the team and, uh, making sure that I can do that to the best of my ability. So I'm just focusing on those small things, uh, just the details of the game, um, and staying in the best mental space I can, uh, I, that I can maintain. So. Before the season, a lot of people probably thought the pass rush would be one of the biggest strengths of this team, especially on the defensive side. Um, just through the first couple of games, how would you kind of grade the uh, the pass rush that you guys have been able to uh, bring? The first couple of games? Well, teams are very scared of our pass rush, so they don't. A lot of times, they don't give us a lot of drop back opportunities. You know, they give the ball out quick. Um, you know, speed option, um, to try and neutralize hard count, you know, anything that they can really do to try and neutralize our pass rush. So, you know, any way that we can make the, uh, make a play, like when they're speed option, when we're still playing the quarterback or playing the pitch, um, anything that we can do to really cause havoc within the game is what we try to do. So, can you take us through the pick six? 